Well, good morning, everywhere. It's the Sig Snob Nation. Papa Sig here with Mama Sig, and a treat for you today. Um, I've noticed that there's been quite a positive response to Mama Sig shooting um, my variety of handguns. So we're gonna do we're gonna continue to do that since you like that, and we just live to do what you like. <laughs> so, so no, we want to do what you're interested in. So um, um, I'm being silly. So today we're gonna to do a little three gun, um, not in the not in this normal sense when you hear three gun of a shotgun, an AR, and a pistol, but a three gun as far as um, this one particular handgun, which is capable in oh, there's some rifle shooting. Too. They get you in shoot is capable in shooting three different rounds, and so that's what we're gonna do. And Mama Sig is gonna shoot these. And she's going to experience a nine millimeter first. Then um, we're going to transition the weapon barrel and whatever is necessary to 40 caliber. And then we're going to move to 357. We have a 357 barrel. We have a 357 magazine and rounds. This is also 40. So, and again, what weapon does all this? The Sig P226. This is in the extreme version. It has the uh, short reset trigger, the SRT which is a nice feature to this 226. Um, the reason why I wanted to feature this gun and the reason why I wanted Mama Sig to shoot this is this was the first uh, weapon that I carried on duty. So I wanted her to know first so, and I started in a nine millimeter and then we moved to 40. So um, I'm gonna um, get her set up on this and then she's gonna shoot each one of these. I'm gonna have her do a mag reload. A lot of good comments on the magazine loading, how, she, how you insisted that she have a loader. She doesn't want to load her. Oh, well, let me say that. Okay. So, okay, that's what we're gonna do. Now I'm gonna now we're gonna switch places and I'm gonna get let her get set up with this SIG P226 in the uh, extreme. We're gonna go nine millimeter, 40 millimeter, 357. That's the plan. And we'll break in between each one of those. Okay, so uh, let's flip sides of the camera. Can we just stop let's it? Yellow to go. Hi, hello. So what am I doing? Picking so, um, yeah, you're gonna shoot the, you're gonna shoot the 226 in nine millimeter first. Uh -huh. So what the way we've set that weapon up is uh, in order to convert it to nine millimeter from the way I purchased it as a 40, I have changed the recoil spring, I've changed the barrel, and we changed the magazines. So uh, right now on the bench, we have uh, a loaded magazine, and then we have a non-loaded magazine. So I figured let's load that magazine, get, uh, cause we said uh, we get some more practice on, nope. I mean, load load rounds into the magazine. Oh, yeah. Okay. I should have that empty chain indicator on there. We should always okay. use that. So safety, safety, safety. Good. Okay, empty chamber in place. So you, there you have the, <laughs> just shooting the rifle up top. There you have the uh, nine millimeter rounds. Mm -hmm. And uh, go ahead and load those. Okay, and okay, wait, this way, right? This way, right? No, wait, okay, this way. I know, you know, I know, is it how? Okay, so yeah. how do I do that? Wait, Push it goes, in that goes that way. Yeah. Okay. So, yes, a where's lot that, of Where's people, your left thumb? Oh, you're, okay, my left, okay. That's, yeah. yeah, get it up there higher. Okay. There you go. So, okay. go ahead. A lot of people have were not a lot, but some comments were saying, okay, why don't I use a loader? Is that what it's called? Yes. Okay, and I don't especially want a loader as I'm just learning. And really, I am just learning. Even though my husband is very knowledgeable about this, I have like zero knowledge. And still, I feel like I'm swimming in this vast ocean of unknowing. <laughs> so why don't I want a loader? Because it's like you said, Mike, fight how you train, train how you fight. And so, you know, really, it, am I really going to get into a firefight? Well, but the whole point is, is I want to know how to load it myself because. Without another, uh, who carries a loader in their pocket? Without a loader. Because right? you don't carry because, that in your pocket. Right. So what am I going to say? Hold on just a minute so I can go get my loader and so I can load. No, I just want to know how to load it myself. I want to know the basics okay. of, of so how, how do you to do, do this. Yeah. 
And so I really hold that thing straight up and know, down, just right. like we. I really practice. don't know how to do this, so I am just learning. Yeah, that's how you do it. Just be consistent and do it that way every time. Mm -hmm. And you know, it's okay that I mean, last week I was really, I didn't really want you to post that video because I was holding the gun wrong. Uh, and you usually correct me and neither of us caught it. And so it was embarrassing to me that I was holding it wrong. But the reality is, is I am just learning and I do not know what I'm doing. So I'm just doing the best I can. Okay, how many, that's a, I'm just gonna tell you, that's a 10 round magazine. Okay. There's 10, 10, there's 10 so rounds in each row. More. Yeah, that helps you. Cause you didn't put that together, I did. So just yeah. to help you. So, you know, yeah. now I have to say, this is a brand new magazine. From oh, is it? It's a, yeah, it's a brand, oh, so this a brand is one new. Ones you got? Yeah, this is a brand new nine millimeter, right straight from SIG for 226. So it's, it's stiff. So that's All pretty right. good. You got nine in, you can only get one more. So that's, that's pretty good if you can get nine rounds. Okay. in a brand new mat okay now what are you gonna do you're gonna seat those on the back. good nice and hard like good they're pretty well set i saw them okay so now let me back up here and get away from the front of the weapon okay so um at this point white put everything down uh and now what do we need we need safety eyes and ears And we need to get you some of the pink ones in now. I think those are those are pretty well. Pardon? We need some pink ones in oh. that. No? <laughs> they make pink ones. Wait, do I have this? You have a red light indicator on there somewhere. Okay, yeah, it's on. Okay. Eyes. Okay. Okay. All right. Now I need to grab mine. Okay. So. You'll hand me those glasses. Are you gonna put them on my head? That's fine. I got a hat on. You have to pull them down a little bit. Yep. Yep. <laughs> ah. Very gentle. <laughs> what? I said that wasn't very gentle. Was it? No, it's fine. <laughs> Send me the sissy. Okay. Sorry. Okay. Good. Okay. Now this is the important part. Okay. You got your ear protection, eyes and ears on, and you're ready to load and uh, make that, that uh, ready that weapon and go to the line. Um, what I, what I'd rather do is have let's do that at the line. So what I what I want you to do is just talk me what you're gonna do without touching anything. What's the first thing you're gonna do with that that pistol? Okay, so so you'll correct me, right? Yeah. Okay, so I'm going to pick it up yes. the correct way, like this. Yes. Right. Take out that yellow thing. What is the yellow thing? I forgot. Yeah. Empty uh, chamber indicator. Empty chamber. Okay, I'm going to pick up the handgun, take out the empty chamber indicator. Okay, and then and, what? And then I'm going to put a mag in. Yep. Well, we will do that. We'll walk forward with the mag, but then yes, you would put the mag in and then what? Okay. We're going to put the mag in at the line, but I want to, I just talk through it. Do I, then I'll decock it? No. Put it on safety? No. Okay. No safety on that gun. I don't know. So I don't so know. So you've got a, you've got a magazine in the mag well, you've got your slide lock back. You've got your slide lock back. What do you got to do? So this right here. You've got a chamber around. So chamber around. How you chamber it is up to you. You can use the slide release lever okay. or you can rack it back. Okay. Got so, that? You know, I feel dumb. No, but no, it just is, takes I have, practice, ha memory. I'm having difficulty remembering all the steps. Like this. Okay. okay, so. Well, um, that's good because most people on video get a, a gun handed to them, loaded, and, and people say shoot it. So you're working right. through the process. Yeah. Okay, so let's do it. Go okay, ahead. So I'll pick it up. Yep. I'll remove this. Yep. Remove. And then, as soon as that out, uh, or when that, even before that out, what? Where is that weapon pointed at all times? Front. And, and never the... anywhere out. Of, wherever you right. move, whatever direction you move, it is always forward. Okay. okay. So grab a mag. Do not load it. Okay. Grab it in your hand. And what we're going to walk. In my pocket, should I get another? One? I'm going to hold the other one. Okay. So you go walk forward. Okay. I'm going to be behind you.
Okay, so you're choosing seven yard line, that's good. Okay, so I'm gonna come around this side and then I want you now to tell me what you're going to do as I tell you to load and make ready. And go ahead and just walk through it. So I put the mag in. Okay. Positive seat, good. Okay. This what you're is gonna this cha chamber, chamber around. Okay, right? Fingers still off the trigger, right? Right, it's, it's yeah. like this. Okay. So, now get, get that right thumb in the air, good. And then do yeah. that? Yep. Okay. So you okay. decocked it, it's de good. Because now you're gonna start in what, what do we call the first shot? Double action, keep that okay, up. Okay, the first shot is double action. The second, and after that is single action. Okay, and I want to note, I am putting my Get your right thumb in the air I'm or fly it. my hand Yeah, that right. allows your left hand to seat up against that grip. Okay. Good. Okay, so okay. that looks pretty good. Um, your feet aren't set at all, so okay. you, there's no way you can shoot like that. Um, I'm gonna walk around and then you're ready, you're hot. So you fire at will and you're at seven yards and um, whenever on you. Good. Ten ring. Now this is going to, oh, stand by. Okay. This is what we call a semi stove pipe. Okay. This is not good, but it's not your fault. It's oh. uh, something's going on with this stuff. So this should have ejected completely. It did not. Okay. So, so either this, these rounds are under powered, which is possible. Um, or we're having an issue with this barrel change. Remember, because we put a nine, we're testing to see if we can put a nine, seeing if we could put a nine millimeter barrel in a 226. Okay. Okay, so at this point, I need you to take the okay. camera because so I need to clear this. Okay. I'm not going to have you clear that. Go ahead. Sorry, and I just put my hand in front of it. Sorry. Okay. Okay, so what do you do with, uh, that's not really a stove pipe, that's a semi stove pipe. A stove pipe as we were that round would be sitting straight up. Okay. But it's close enough. So uh, the way I have to clear a stove pipe is I drop the mag okay. like that. And uh, I caught it because there's there's rounds in it. Right, that's why you didn't drop. let it drop. Okay. All right. But I still have what we call the stove pipe there. So I'm gonna pull that back, clear it, let that go. I'm gonna function the weapon as I can't pull the trigger on this one because it's California. So I'm gonna uh, clear it as best as I can. As far as I'm concerned, that's clear. Now when I did that, you can see I dropped around. Yes. Um, I'm just going to leave that there till later. Since we had that issue, I'm going to take over at this point to see if we've got a serious problem. Okay. With uh, with using this nine millimeter conversion. Okay. To this, so I won't shoot your target. I'll shoot that piece of paper up there. So let me see if we're going to have a problem with this. Ready? Red eye. Paper's moving. Ooh, you got it. <laughs> no problem. Good the shot. Past, past cycles. See that? So you might have lip wristed it. Um, you know what that means? You might have eh, let it go. And you can't do that with this gun. You might you might have lip it. You gotta really get into it and lock out. sound of the trouble. Waiting for the sound to recover. Probably have it now. Okay, so the gun is going to function okay with this nine millimeter setup in it. You saw that, right? Right. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to hand you this empty, safe and empty gun. We'll try it again. And then you set up, I'll give you a, a full magazine and we'll go from there. Okay. So there we go. And How are you doing that? Were you doing that backwards? No, I'm holding it backwards. Duh. <laughs> okay, I'm coming around just so I can see this side. There's your magazine. Okay, let's try it again. Yep, let's try this again. Now remember, you gotta lock out. 
your wrist can't be limp. Okay. That's, it, it did that, it's called limp wristing it. You gotta lock those wrists out. Okay. Now go ahead, do, yeah, go ahead and fire in single action. Do not decock this not time. Decock. Okay. Fire in single action. Is that, so, <laughs> I'm sorry. Single action means the hammer, the hammer is back. Right. So and you're just... gonna have half the pull on your trigger. Okay. It's gonna be like four pounds versus that big long pull that you already did and you hit the 10 ring with the first one. Right. In double action, so you can shoot double action. So leaving single action for the first shot means that that's just back. Yeah. Okay. I mean, you're, you're not, you don't decock it, good. Stuff, but I don't, I don't okay, so. go ahead. Make sure your wrists are locked out, push into that gun. Okay. Don't push it when it fires, let it shoot, lock out and then squeeze the trigger. Oh. Yeah, it, that's what happens in single action. It stays in single action okay. after you've shot it. Okay. It's a double action, single action. Okay, it's yeah, not going to go to double action again until I don't you put it there. All of that, but okay. Okay. So, and look at look at the condition. I felt like I was locked out. Okay. Well, you know, I don't know. Could be it could be the ammo. Um so let's do that. Let's clear let's have you clear it this time. Okay? This so is how you clear a stovepipe. You drop the magazine. Good. Oops, wait. It's fine. That's fine. Okay. You don't have to necessarily catch it. Okay, now what okay. do I do with this? Now you gotta get that empty casing out of the chamber because the gun didn't do it. Just pull it back. Good. Empty okay. came is dropped. Okay, now rack it and clear it. See if it's clear. Like, Cycle it a few that? times. Yeah. Okay, you can't pull the trigger because it's right. a California model. Okay. okay, so go ahead and um, keep uh, step to your left. My left. I'm gonna pick this up. Keep pointing down range. Uh -huh. okay. Okay. Yeah. So just stand by a second. I'm gonna set you up. Okay, there's the mag. Okay, now, yeah, let's do this. This is gonna be harder because go ahead and insert that magazine. Insert it. No, insert the magazine. Okay. Okay, now you're gonna to have to rack that round from the, from the slide lock. So you, you gotta really get into that thing and don't help it go forward or okay. else it will. Pull it back? Yeah. Okay. Good. That is very hard to do. That was good. That was very positive. Okay, you're ready to go. Single action, you're ready to fire. Oops, I gotta back up. You told me to get your shoes. God, I gotta go way back here to get your shoes. Okay, go ahead. Lock those, that right wrist particularly, you gotta lock that out. Nope, stand by. Okay, it could be the, I'm not blaming you completely. It could be the ammo as well. Okay, so I'm gonna switch with you. So Here. this is the problem. I mean, okay. how am I supposed to learn? Oops, wrong way. So how am I supposed to learn how to shoot if that keeps happening? Cause I'm well, a beginner. This shouldn't happen. So this is what we're working through. Okay. And, and Sam, we're gonna move to the 40 and we'll switch it over and you won't have this problem. Okay. Okay, so how do I clear it? You drop it and you catch it since it's got rounds in it. Drop that. I'm gonna pocket that because it has rounds in it. Drop it. Okay. Okay. Then I'm going to see. Okay. Why are is it are the is it the, the rounds that are doing that? What what's that? What is that the same size or different size? Same. Okay. No, I haven't switched anything. Oh, okay. We have to go back and change barrels and everything. Okay. And I'm gonna rack this, chamber this, and then I'm gonna fire this. Ready? Ready. 